Hi, welcome to Buzz, Indiana's Underground Business Voice. My name is Tony Selzo. We're here at the main event, actually going on outside. It's the first main event in about eight years that I haven't actually participated in. That's kind of a new thing, right? Well, you missed a good night, Tony. A good day? Good day. All right, good. Andy Corman, AC Trash Hauling. All right, well, there's so many good, good things I want to talk to you about, but, but how did you get into this trash hauling business, Andy? Absolutely by accident. I know. Okay. Absolutely by accident. 2008. Laid off. I'm a structural engineer. Uh -huh. Spent 30 plus years in construction management building large commercial jobs. Uh -huh. Laid off. The economy went boom. Mm -hmm. I'm out on the street. Yeah. Long story short, out for a walk with my neighbor. He says, you got that truck? Go haul trash. Uh -huh. He walked in his house. Next night, I don't see signs on the truck. What's the matter? Sit down. Let's have a chat. Over the course of the next couple of days, I said, I'm going to the trash hauling business because it was a numbers game. Uh -huh. I added it up and said, there's nobody in Hamilton County or one person in Hamilton County doing it with a presence. Yeah. I looked at it and said, there's room for one more. Uh -huh. Did the math and said, if I can do X number of jobs a day, I can make some money and I never ever have to go back to corporate America. Uh -huh. So I decided Monday morning, June 30th, 2008, I'm going to the trash hauling business. Uh -huh. Spent $100. <laughs> business signs, cards and signs. signs yeah. At noon, I look at my neighbor's house, and there's 30 bags of trash lined in the driveway for sale by owner. I call this, this number, have no idea who I'm talking to, and the first question is, are you with the Homeowners Association? <laughs> I know. No, ma'am, I'm not. I'm here to protect you from them. <laughs> yeah. And she says, what? I says, I'm here to protect you. I haul trash. I'll haul your trash away. And she paid me that night, and that's how it started. Wow, awesome. So I, I think um, what's so important for people to hear is not only, I mean, I mean we've, we've used you several times. You guys are great. We do a great job, and, and we, it's, it's always better than we expected. And, 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 that, and that people are going to get that when they, they, mm -hmm. they, they deal with you. And that, but, but, man, how cool is it that we live in a country that that's what you can do to start a business? Just, just wake up and decide that, that what I was doing before wasn't paying the bills. Yeah, and, and not only that, and just and with, and with 100 bucks and some sheer determination. Determination, lots of that. You, you, I mean, you sweat equity into this thing, mm -hmm. and now you're, you're moving. You've got moving. it growing. Moving. So talk to me about where you guys are at now. Well, uh, this year, w without real numbers, I've grown the business 150% from 2009. Wow. I'm going to do close to 400 jobs this year. Nice. Uh, uh, and, and it continues to grow. Nice. And what would you say is your primary method of marketing? The best method is, is obviously networking. Yeah. Because uh, truthfully, I don't know who my customers are. <laughs> yeah. I mean, uh, there's thousands, you know, hundreds of thousands of people in Hamilton County. Yeah. But I can't mass mail, I can't touch base with everybody. Mm -hmm. So I, I network my butt off. Uh -huh. And I deal with the, the realtors, and I deal with financial people, and insurance agents, and contractors. You're finding these other points of influence that are dealing with people around the move, when they when they're need, mm -hmm. have needs. You're getting your word in front of them, and you're taking good care of them. You're making them look like a hero when they, when they call, when exactly. they make those calls for you. You respond quickly. Quickly. And, and, you're, and you're, you're not the cheapest, but you're fair. And, and your guys show up, you're trustworthy. I mean, you know, it, it's we, not rocket science. It's not rocket science. When we say we're going to be there, we're going to be there. Yeah. And we say we're going to get the job done, we're going to get the job done for the price we quoted at. So if you're a financial planner, you're an insurance guy, you're, you're um, um, is a mortgage broker, you're somebody in that, that opportunity where you're getting transition, you need to get junk out of a house, you need to get, mm -hmm. you need to get trash hauled so you get this thing rented or sold. Exactly. The, you're a great resource. If you're if you're a, a apartment uh, a management company, great resource. For great you. resource. Okay, but but not only that. I mean, if you're somebody that is in the home doing construction, doing those type of things, you're causing the mess. You're a great resource. Great resource. So so I mean, really, just one of the best rainmaker stories we got going is your business right now, and I appreciate everything that you've done for us and everything you do for rainmakers. Man, it's so glad to have you on. Thanks, Tony. My pleasure, brother. You've been bust.